Alrighty then, it is International Podcast Day week, which is, you know, it's like Christmas, it's Christmas week, it's like your birthday, it's birthday week. That is why this week I'm continuing the celebrations by spotlighting a couple more people that I believe are doing wonderful things in the world of podcasting. And this person that I am spotlighting today, the man himself, it's the person that without, without, without this guy in my life, I would not be doing what I'm doing today, either in podcasting or in life. So I owe a debt of gratitude to the person that I am talking about today. This is the Podcast Accelerator. I'm Mark Asquith, that British podcast guy and CEO and co-founder here at Rebel Base Media, where we make podcasting products that include podcast websites, the Podcast Success Academy, Podcast Design Studio. We've got our own little recording studio where we help companies brand and launch their own podcasts. But we also run Captivate.fm, the world's only growth-oriented podcast host, where you can enjoy multiple podcasts under one account, in limited team members. I nearly said infinite and unlimited together. So in limited team members, advanced analytics, now with Spotify data directly in your dashboard, all for one cost. 19 bucks a month is going to get you everything that you need. So go and try it out for seven days completely free at Captivate.fm. Now, like I said, I'm going to shine a light on a great friend of mine in just one second. But before I do that, a quick heads up that Aweber are still giving you for a limited time that 90 days free trial. It is it is a limited time because we're changing this, all right? We're tweaking it. We're going ahead and we're going to be tweaking things up and changing things up. What I want you to realize is that Email marketing is absolutely vital to everything that you do with your podcast, all right? I I truly believe that if you're not building relationships with your listeners via email, you're missing a trick. So please go ahead and check that out over at markasquith.com forward slash Aweb. get 90 days totally for free. Now, did you know that my first ever podcast five years ago was a podcast called Two Shots to the Head that we we changed in the end to be called the DC Universe Show. Now, I'm a huge Star Wars geek, but I'm an even bigger DC Comics geek. I absolutely love it. I'm the guy that predicted that this year's massive Christ on Infinite Earths crossover that they're doing over on the Warner Brothers CW channels would exist, and I predicted that 10 years ago. And I've been bleating and beating on about that for years. I am that big a DC Comics geek, all right? But I wasn't always confident about that because it's not cool or it wasn't cool. I mean, it's cool now, but I mean, it's cool because I make it cool and I say it's cool. It is cool, all right? But back then I didn't have the confidence to do that. But I knew that I wanted, back in my hacksaw days, that I wanted to do something more creative for myself. So I approached... A guy that I'd seen on Twitter, I thought, honestly, was a little bit above my station. Like, he was a little bit smarter than me. He seemed to be doing really well for himself. And I was kind of honoured that he actually engaged with me. And I've got to know him. He's not like that at all. He's a complete nerd like I am. And he's a complete legend. And this guy, Mr. Gary Aylert, go and look him up. Gary Aylert is a wonderful designer, an amazing interface designer, and he's just an absolute talent. We created this DC Comics podcast from the back of a DM on Twitter, right? And we actually started life as a blog and we came up with the name Two Shots to the Head, which is a quote from Batman Dart Victory, quoted by Harvey Dent. Um, Two Shots to the Head, it couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. It's from a, a, the long Halloween follow-up, which is Batman Dart Victory, which I urge you to dig, dig into. It's a bit of a gangster story in the Batman universe. So please go and check into that. It's wonderful. Amazing cover as well. And we created this show and we created this, this blog and we... We decided that we were going to blog every single day for a year. And we did. We Two shots to the head. By the time we finished, I don't know why we pulled it offline, really. We should have kept it. That's a shame. I hope we've got the backup somewhere for that. We created for a year. And it was wonderful. We were just right. And honestly, we stuck to it. We did a blog post every day for a year about comics and pop culture. And then we niched down into podcast, uh, sorry, niche down into DC Comics. It was wonderful. And the site design was great. Gaz designed it. I built it. And it was brilliant. It was fantastic. And then we stopped. I got busy with podcast websites, subsequently Rebel Base Media. And Gary got busy um, doing his own thing. He scratched his own itch when we finished in 2014. We finished um, early 2014, two shots to the head. Gary created the Doctor Who Big Blue Box podcast with his friend Adam, which is wonderful. 245 episodes in. And it started March 31st, 2014. 
2014 and published its last episode, most recent episode, in September this year. And I'm sure that will continue long into the future. And that, of course, is hosted on Captivate as well. Now, what I want you to understand with this is that five years ago, I was coerced into this. I was coerced into this by Gaz. A duet show, two shots to the head. And this guy, Gary, really, he, he, he really is one of the UK's foremost pop culture podcasters with the big blue box. And of course, now with Spark of Rebellion, which is our Star Wars podcast. And I've got immense gratitude for him twisting my arm and saying, look, Mark, podcasts aren't for people that want to talk about the TV show Lost in the Basement. They're for cool guys like us. And I'm like, wait a second, we're exactly like those people. We are those people. And he made me buy a blue snowball mic and the audio, my audio was crap. His audio was fantastic. And he got me started. And without that domino falling, without him doing that, I would not be doing what I'm doing today. I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing today. Captivate would not exist. Podcast websites, the academy, productivity, rebel Base media would not exist without Gary just tipping that domino over. So I am forever grateful for him unwittingly igniting a passion in me that five, six years later has turned into a career and has, has generated me hundreds of friends across the planet, one of which I will always be grateful for, which is you, Gary Aylert. Thank you, brother. I love it, and I love you to bits, dude. We do this show, Spark of Rebellion, every single week, and honestly, it's difficult because we're both so busy, but it's one thing that we continue to do. Sometimes we're going to move the days of recording. Sometimes we do a slightly shorter show, but we turn up and we produce because we love it. And I love shooting the breeze with Gaz when it comes to Star Wars. So, dude, without without you, man, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing. So much love, honestly. He's an amazing guy. He's an amazing family man, an amazing talent, a wonderful pop culture podcaster, one of the foremost podcasters in the UK. Please go and check out the Doctor Who Big Blue Box podcast. And in my feed right now, you are going to see a bonus episode. It's episode 24 of Spark of Rebellion, the full episode 24 of Spark of Rebellion. I want you to go and check that out just because it's fun. All right. And I've got to warn you, there's a couple of F-bombs in there. All right. So please go and check it out. And remember, I appreciate you. Please tell your friends that this show is available to listen to on any app that supports podcasts completely for free. And until the next time, go check out Captivate.fm for your podcast hosting needs. It's free for seven days and the best platform on the planet. To quote Chris Ducker, effing hell, mate, you're knocking it out of the park with this one. Thanks, bro. Go and check it out, Captivate.fm. And until the next time, never forget, the more you expect from yourself, the more you will excel.